Hello guys, on this video we are going to build a simple application where the goal is to connect a button to the Swift code and here we are going to count the number of clicks. So let's build it. Let's start by creating a new project. For that, let's go to File, New, and Project. Okay, so here you should select Single View App. Let's click in Next and give the name Button Action App. You can give another name, but for now, let's keep it like this. And here it's important to select the language as Swift use the interface as storyboard. Let's go to these ones. Uh, you can change it and give uh, another name. So next, let's create. Yeah, okay. That seems like I already have an app with the, that name, so let's change to two. Yeah, okay. Let's create. So let's build the user interface first. So let's go to main.storyboard. Here you can change this color to another one. Let's change it. Hey, let's yeah. Exactly. Let's select and change it to orange. I like it this way and uh, add the label and the button the label to display the number of clicks and the button to perform the action so label right here yeah okay so let's build let's put some constraint to this so if you want to know more of, about constraint there will be upcoming videos about that, so don't forget to subscribe, to don't miss that. So to center this button, we are going to select this both with zero. It will be centered now. Yeah, exactly. And this one, yeah, we can leave it that uh, right there. Just, uh, let's just center horizontally and keep the constraints as they are now, like this. It yeah, seems good. To build some actions to this button and to change the label, let's go here and assistant to change it programmatically. Let's create first of all an variable with the number of clicks. Bar, let's call it num of clicks and the initial value of zero. Let's connect this label on this button to the code. You should press control and while you are pressing uh, sorry, while you are pressing control you should do this and uh, place the label right here and give it the name uh, number label like that and connect and we will do the same control and here on the button and uh, the type you can change this for be more specific to a Y button and the name that's a button click click yeah right that I hope I don't have any typo here but I think it's okay connect so when the view loads you should change this label to zero because it's the current number of clicks and when the user press this button 
this function will run and it should change as well the number of clicks and display that number here so we can create a function to, to to change the label so we don't have to repeat code let's create that function here so func change click Like this and so and like I said this function should be called both here and here and the, on this function we should change the text change the text let's call the num yeah exactly dot text equals and you should put a string here and this is an integer and uh, to change the integer to string you can do it like this Just call the string method and pass the number of clicks as parameter like this and now to count the number of clicks before calling this method you should also change this part for that let's copy and you can change it like this plus equal one and this way when you press the button one is added to this variable and the label is changed okay let's see if this works Yeah, exactly. Let's press the button. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, exactly. If you want to give some background to see it better, you can go to main.storyboard, uh, select this, and let's give some background like this one. Pink, I don't know. Yeah, it can be. It's not the prettiest application, but it works. Let's run again. Thanks guys for watching. I hope to make more videos like this on iOS development. So if you like it or if you have any suggestion for improvement, please leave the comment below and subscribe to the channel. Thanks. See you in the next one.